The weather's turned out great. Uh, we're going to have a great evening and get uh, Wonderland kicked off in style here tonight. And we're glad you're here because it wouldn't be the same without you. You know, uh, my name is Steve Carlisle, and I'm the chairman of the Convention and Visitors Bureau here. And we've got a great uh, group of people. We've got some of the folks that serve on the board here tonight. And uh, if you ever have questions or ideas about tourism, we want to tell you that we'd love to hear from you. Uh, our idea and hope is that we increase tourism here in Marshall. Uh, we help our businesses, we help our community, and, and that's what we're here for. And last year was our first year to start working on Wonderland, and uh, last year was a good start. Uh, this year we want it to be even better. We've got some great new attractions. My favorite is the double-decker bus that I took a, uh, a test drive on today, and you're going to love that. The bus is uh, all the way from England. You might have noticed, I think there was some information in the paper uh, last day or so about uh, Wonderland of Lights being advertised and shown uh, at Times Square in New York. Our Wonderland of Lights has really gotten to be a national phenomenon. And so I think that's really uh, important for us to have a great festival and we're really looking forward to this being the best Wonderland ever. We hope to improve it every year. But Wonderland of Lights was born with a flash of inspiration uh, 25 years ago. Uh, George Smith and, and JC will tell you more about that, but so many people have worked on this and, and, and they are volunteers that have worked very hard and we appreciate them. We appreciate the city of Marshall uh, and all the help that they've given. Uh, we appreciate all the folks that work at the Convention and Visitors Bureau, uh, our sponsors, uh, our uh, local businesses that have pitched in, our donors, uh, our vendors. We also really appreciate the county working with us on using parts of the parking lot over here uh, and their help on different things with the skating ring. Uh, several folks have done uh, just fantastic work. Geraldine Mouthy, uh, Ed Michelle, John Aaron, uh, Bo Ellis, and J.C. Hughes have all done just a, a great, great job. And I really appreciate uh, so much of the hard work that so many people have done and so I really would like to give all of them a round of applause for all the effort that they put in. <laughs> Along with uh, John Aaron Z Group uh, and his group of employees have also helped too. So with, uh, I want to introduce now uh, Dr. Dub Oliver, president of ETBU, who will uh, lead us in our invocation. Dub? Would you pray with me? Almighty God, you are the creator of life. We come before you tonight in a spirit of thanksgiving for all that you have done for us, all that you are doing in us. And we thank you, Father, for all that will be. Lord, I ask now that you would bless the wonderland of lights, that this... Um, this evening, tonight, Lord, and throughout the whole celebration would be a wonderful time for family and friends to gather, to make memories, to share special moments together. And Lord, we pray for the safety and protection for all who travel here to see this and be a part of it. We pray for all the vendors, Lord, for everybody who's involved. And Lord, most of all, what we hope is that this wonderland of lights would be a reflection of your son Jesus who is indeed the light of the world we pray all of this in his name amen good evening my name is Ashley Acker I'm the news director for KMHT radio here in Marshall 103.9 I'm so glad to be a part of this 25th annual Wonderland of Lights I was five years old when I came to the first one if you were at the first one you know we have come a long way since then one of the things we know in Texas is everything's bigger and everything is better. And that is especially true here tonight, the 25th Annual Wonderland of Lights. I'm so honored to introduce one of our guests this evening, Ms. Kendall Morris, Miss Texas. Kendall, thank you so much for being here this evening. I'm honored to have you. Kendall is from Ennis. She does have some East Texas roots. I do. I do. Uh, this is actually my first Wonderland of Life, though. Last year, 
Uh, I interned at KYTX, CBS 19 in Tyler, and so I was out in the Marshall area a lot, but I never got the chance to come to the Wonderland of Lights, so I'm very excited to be here and see all the lights this year. Well, we're glad to have you. You're really going to see a treat this evening. I, I tell you what, why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself? Well, uh, like you said, I grew up in Ennis, Texas, born and raised there. I went to Texas Christian University as a freshman two years ago. I was very fortunate to be the Texas Christian University featured twirler, and I twirled with them at the Fiesta Bowl and the Rose Bowl most recently. Uh, and then I decided to pursue the title of Miss Texas this past summer, and I represented the city of Frisco, and I was very fortunate to be named Miss Texas, and I'll be representing the state of Texas in the Miss America pageant in January. Well, we're so glad you're here with us tonight. We're glad that all of you are here with us as well. I tell you what, some people that were very instrumental in making the first Wonderland of Lights happen are here this evening. I would like to introduce tonight uh, to the stage J.C. Hughes and George Smith, both of who helped light up the first Wonderland of Lights 25 years ago, and they're going to help lead the countdown again tonight. So let's welcome both of them to the stage now. Uh, what we have here is brains and brawn. Wonderland of Lights is not about lights. It's about the spirit of the holiday season. And it's about the gift that Marshall gives every single year to hundreds of thousands of people throughout the United States. So thank you all very much. And we really, really appreciate everybody coming in. And thank you to Marshall for keeping the Wonderland of Lights going. Everybody watch the screen, we're counting down to 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one.
great show. The light shows, we're going to have more of them this year. Uh, they start at 6 each evening. And then uh, every 30 minutes there will be a light show uh, throughout the rest of uh, Wonderland. So uh, you'll have plenty of time to, and chances to see the light show. And there will be more songs uh, and, and more uh, different light shows uh, the way they'll have those set up. So you'll really enjoy that. Santa knows that God's children that they do. You'll get a chance to speak to Santa. We're so glad you're here. Uh, Wonderland for 2011 is officially open. Thank you very much for being here. Have a great evening. <laughs>